about the dog. Let's get rich. If you stack it, not worry about no bread. Ain't no way that you can get it. I'm trying to get rich. Stacking paper, trying to live a better life. I can't be broke. Worry about no jewels and nothing. Let's get rich. I can't go where the paper don't flow. I can't hang if you ain't about the dog. Let's get rich. I'm just trying to get rich. I can't go where the paper don't flow. I can't hang if you ain't about the dust. Get rich. If you stack it, not worry about no bread. Ain't no way that you can get it. I'm trying to get rich. Stack your paper, trying to live a better life. I can't be broke. Worry about no jewels and nothing. Let's get rich. I can't go where the paper don't flow. I can't hang if you ain't about the dust. Let's get rich. Hey you guys, welcome back to the Dre Day All Day Er Day YouTube channel got me a faux loco And I'm finna show y'all how to do a two strand twist If you are an amateur like me So first you need to wrench your hair, wrench around and wrench it off Wrench the water and then get you some shampoo I use creamy alloy, whatever that was uh, uh, I usually don't do shampoo, but since my sister gave it to me, I was like, I'm going to go ahead and use it. What I usually do is, up, oh, get that off the face, okay? So what I usually do is uh, the uh, organic apple cider vinegar. That's what I usually do to my hair. But since my sister gave it to me, I was like, I'll go ahead and finish off the bottle for her. So, make sure you lather it up, get into the roots, and get it all airware, get it airware, get, get, yep, use the rest of it, use the rest of it, and so, this is if, like, I do this if you're a beginner, because I've been growing my hair for about three years, and I would twist my hair whenever I'm too poor to go get it braided, okay? All right, we rinsed it off, did a little quick rinse off of it because we're going to put some other stuff in my hair. And get, yeah, get that, wipe that off, wipe that off. I don't know if that's sweat or water, Jesus. This is why it takes me forever to do my hair. I play too much. Anywho, so one thing that I also do once I get the apple cider vinegar out of my hair, I put an avocado in my hair. Mainly because I really don't eat meat. I try to lay off the meat. And so an avocado is a good way of putting protein back in your hair. And then we also going to uh, use an egg. Just, you know, just to piggyback off of uh, putting protein in your hair. Helping it grow, helping it stay nice and strong. Yeah, go and take that pit out. We don't need that pit, Andre. All right. Girl, is it me or do I look like Sideshow Bob, child, from The Simpsons with this red hair, this discount Shaka Khan look I got going on? Look, my hard-headed ass done broke the egg with my head. Oh, my Jesus. All right. Some people just use the egg yolk. Oh, this is another thing. Uh, I also use organic coconut oil. I'm just mix that in there. I really don't even buy hair care products. All my hair care stuff comes from the kitchen, comes from the grocery aisle. I really don't. And we're going to mix it up. And I tell people, uh, if you use so many, like, uh, chemicals from the color folks section or you have to order so much stuff to put in your hair, oh, you're not natural. You're not natural. Natural means you use less chemicals as possible. Or don't use any at all. Most of the stuff that we need for our hair, look, stirring up, stirring up the gifts. And then we're just going to pour that in the hair. But yeah, the most stuff that you need to put on your hair or that your hair needs, you can do it through a diet or just simply just putting the hair and putting the food on your hair. You get what I'm saying? Yep, just pour it. Yep, yep. yep. You see what he's doing? Just do that. Some people use the egg yolk, just the egg yolk, but I uh, I don't like to be wasteful, so I use the whole egg, and I don't mind. But anywho, 
What's next, child? We're going to uh, wrap my hair up in some plastic. And then we're going to leave it on there for like 30 minutes. Like after I finish, finish rubbing that. Oh, my goodness. Andre, hair it up. Jesus. But, uh, yeah. We're going to wrap it up and leave it in there for 30 minutes. Now, let me tell you something. If you want to put egg in your hair, make sure you stay cool. My fat ass had to put a fan in front of me to make sure I stay cool. Because if you, if any warm or room temperature stuff touches that egg, I, let's, we'll just say, you. I mean, we'll be serving you for breakfast, girl. Because you're going to be having cooked egg all in your hair. And you don't want that. Don't nobody want cooked egg in their hair. I got pieces of avocado all in my head. See, just get, get, get you a Kroger bag and whoop, there it is. I just like 30 minutes later, I am turd. You hear me? I am turd. And then we're going to do, we're going to, um, we're going to wrench around and wrench it off again. And when you wrench the egg out your hair, make sure it's cold water. Because uh, let me reiterate, you do not want cooked egg. Look, let's do a dance to it. You don't want cooked egg in your her no you don't amen hallelujah all right now if my fro would stay like this all day i would just be like this all day i wouldn't even twist my hair but the lord has not blessed me with <laughs> with hair that retains liquid <laughs> so i have to do other stuff to buy her i either have to twist it or get it braided because lord knows i'm gonna stay like this that afro is so neat i like it when it's like that it's just full of water full of nutrients it's just just full of life and two minutes later it's full of air and it's all shriveled up and shrunk up and broke busted and disgusted yeah I come out the shower and look like Shaka Khan. Child, a few minutes later, I look like Lauren Hill. I don't know what be going on. <laughs> I don't know what be going on. But anyway, I separated my hair to like eight different parts or eight different sections so that it can be easier to maintain. And then I get a blow dryer and then I'll blow dry my hair. Uh, that kind of like straightens it out a little bit so I get the maximum length to my hair. And you want to make sure it's on low because... Uh, heat, it's okay for your hair, but too much of it can, like, for real dry it out, and it just won't look right. So I make sure, make sure it's on really, really low. Oof, oof, oof. Make sure it's really, really low. <laughs> and then I use Jamaican mango and lime twisting gel. I really don't use, I used to use my cousin who used to do my hair. I don't stop talking to her because she's a, a whole hoe. Anyway, she used to put uh, beeswax in my hair. And then somebody was like, Andre, you don't. Oh, I'm a... okay. So what I'm doing is, this is the part I have blow dry. Look, look at the back of that kitchen. I see why people relax their hair. Anyway, you grab a little bit of hair, grab a little bit of gel. That's all you need. Just a little bit of that and a little bit of that. It goes a long way. You don't need a whole lot. And then you just rub it through the hair. Separate the hair into two different strands. And then you start a twisting, 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 twisting. You really can't see because, you know, I just started. I got bad lighting. Give me a few months and I'll be good to go. And when I get down to the itty bitty kind, itty bitty parts of the hair, I got fat ass fingers. I ain't got time for that. So I just twist it around. And then, you know, once the hair like settles and dries up in a few days, it'll twist on its own. So I'm doing another one just to reiterate. Grab your little piece of hair. And this is free form, by the way. I don't even know if I mentioned that earlier. This is all free form. Because uh, I ain't got time to be trying to part the back of my head and all the other stuff. I can't see. And, oh, my God, it takes me forever to do the back part. And I'd be so bored. And you can tell later on in the video because I start dancing and singing to myself. But anyway, so someone had peed game to me. It was like, Andre, you know, beeswax and gels kind of clog up the pores in your hair or in your head, and your scalp, you know, you should use gel. So everything I use is like either gel-based or water-based. Well, mostly water-based. I don't even know if there's a such thing as gel-based. But everything that I put in my hair is like either gel, air, or water, or oil. Look, this is what takes me forever to do my hair. 
I give somebody $20 and they can figure out what song I'm singing because I ain't going to play it on here because I did not have to pay for it. But I'll give you a hint. It's by somebody by the name of uh, Giselle. Yeah, 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 yeah. Somebody by the name of Giselle. If you know what song I'm singing by, song by a person named Giselle, drop down in the comment section, let me know. And let me know where I can cash app you. Let me know where I can cash up you and I'll send you $20 if you can figure that out. Anywho, yeah, this takes forever. It was something else I was going to tell y'all. But yeah, I always tell people if you have to use so many chemicals, like the only thing I would use would be that shampoo and that, uh, that twisting gel because they don't sell gels like that in the grocery part of the store. So it is what it is. Okay. Oh my God. I did not realize I was singing for so long on this damn video. I, I wish I could have went back and just edit this whole thing out. But this is what it takes me so long to do my hair. Let me tell y'all from beginning to end, it takes me like four hours to do my hair. Because I will like apple cider it and then uh, avocado it and hot oil it and recolor it and then twist it. That takes like four hours. So it, I literally would dedicate a whole day just to do my hair. Most likely it'll be Saturdays so I could watch me some Law & Order SVU. But since I'm recording, I was like, I'm going to have to entertain myself with some music. Moving right along. Oh, Lord, not even moving right along. I'm still doing the back, Jesus. Come on, we need the hair to get to the front. Where it's exciting. In the front and in the side. Look. Look at this fool. Look at this fool. He swear he can sing. He a hot ass mess. But anyway, I'm going to tell y'all, whenever uh, whenever I get done with my hair, I just put a bonnet on my head and then just go on about my day. And if I wake up in the morning and it's dry, I just rinse it with water and then keep it going. Water is okay to put in your hair every day. Black people don't need to wash their hair every day, but it don't hurt if you rinse it off every now and then. Okay, this is a little FYI uh, for the black folks only. White people, yeah, you wash your hair every day. You know, do not go a day without. What the hell am I doing? Why am I jumping like that? Don't go a day without wash your hair, white people. Now, if my hair stay like this, that's me after I blow, blow dried it. <laughs> I wish my hair stayed like that too. Okay, here we go. Bam. And there we is, all done. Look, I'm exposing y'all. I'm Janet Jackson, y'all, right there with the taco meat and everything. Look, see, there it is. You can finally see. Get your little part of the hair, put some gel on it, and separate into two different parts, and then just twist it. And when you get down to the end, just r uh, roll it around with your finger, and then blop. Look, my dumb ass, it fell. And flap right in my damn eye. Who that hurt? When I tell you that hoy, that hurt it. Anywho, okay, my eye ain't red. I'm good. But yeah, I'm on the last one. And if you ever mess up, don't worry about messing up. It's perfectly fine. If you ever mess up, you twist. You feel like you don't have enough hair. Or you did a little bit too much. Just take it apart, twist it, pull it. Like if you twist it a couple of times. Pull it down or uh, pull it, pull the two strands further apart so that the twist can go down to the root and then finish twisting it. And then, bam, you're done. And I think that's what I did right here when I had messed it up. Yep, just undo it, retwist it, re gel it down if you need to. And then pull it, whoo, like you tie your shoe. And bam, you are done. And you can rock, I rocked this for about like a month or two. Ooh, excuse me, because it don't twist, it doesn't lock or anything. So I'll rock this for a few months. Just make sure I keep my hair wrapped up. Ooh, look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Damn, I'm pretty. <laughs> <laughs> make sure y'all like or even dislike the video. I don't even care. Or if you got some pointers for me, drop down in the comment section and let me know. And uh, yeah, that's it. I wish Andre would hear the hell up. Yep. How you doing? Make sure you like, comment, don't like, subscribe.